Oh, you poor child. Oh, to be an orphan. There's so much life ahead of you. Your grandmother taken from you in a car accident as your parents were when you were just a toddler. It is a cruel, cruel world. I wish I'd been brave enough in life to tell you this. There were many times that I wanted to tell you, but the words would not come. I was a coward and afraid. You're adopted. You were found in the woods near Bennington House, a boarding school for girls upstate. Shouldn't have come here. Hello, you must be Angela. Welcome to Bennington House. I really, really want to, but... But? I want it to be perfect. It is perfect. I mean, we're under one roof for the whole summer, thanks to that fire at Whitney Prep. You, Angela, you're about to join the group of elite young ladies. Summer. This is a boarding school for girls. Adding boys into the mix, there will be a chaperone from Whitney Prep staying on their floor. We have enough trouble with them being down the road. Graham wondered whatever happened to the baby. I think she kept it, and they grew up together, and they're best friends, almost like sisters. That sounds lovely. Where the child was too much of an inconvenience, and she gave her or him away on her way to the airport, like garbage. I'm Victoria Hemsdale. That's Kyle, Tiffany, and oh yes, Bladen. I'm Angela. Oh my god, I love your brooch. It's so pretty. It's not pretty, stupid. It's gorgeous. Thanks. <laughs> my grandmother gave it to me. Then it's an heirloom. Yeah, I guess. Oh, <laughs> thank god. We hoped you weren't on scholarship like Tiffany. <laughs> no offense. Ladies, please meet Mistress Bennington down in the main dining room for me. God, another meeting. Didn't we just have one? What now? Maybe it's good news. You are so dense. Anyway, you better hurry up and get dressed. <laughs> you can't wear that downstairs. I can tell you now, we're gonna be best friends this summer. <laughs> Before I begin, I'd like to introduce a new transfer student, Angela Wentworth. Miss Wentworth will be spending her summer and her senior year at Bennington House. I trust you will all make her feel at home. I'm talking to you in groups to discuss our new temporary living situation. As you know, there's been a fire at Whitney Prep. So for the summer, several of the Whitney Prep students will be sharing our space. Remember, you are young ladies and have the utmost respect for yourselves. Manners and grace are most important. We do understand that fraternization is inevitable. However, there will be zero tolerance if any young lady is found in a young man's room or vice versa. 
Gentlemen. Should you not be at your meeting? Yes, Mr. Spennington, sorry. Uh, we got lost. And we heard voices and thought this might be the room. Hello, ladies. No, it is not, Mr. Ferguson. It is the room below us. Ah, oh, so it is. Sorry. They teach you honor and respect at Whitney Prep, Mr. Bartholomew? Oh, yeah. I mean, yes, Mr. Spinner. And you all are from good families, correct? Herr Fleischer. <laughs> yeah, Flo Bennington. And then this summer, will be without incident? <clears throat> of course. You can go now. Sorry for the intrusion. Apology accepted. <laughs> 